Hi everyone, uh, welcome to Algebra Talks uh, at Algebra University College. Here we are with Daniel, the head of our undergraduate study program in software engineering. Okay, Daniel, let's talk. How much time does it take to become a quality programmer? Well, it all depends on the person. We have many examples that uh, <clears throat> students start actually working on a second year of study and some actually acquire three years. We don't push these things. These things happen spontaneously. So what about uh, practical work at Algebra, like labs or something? When does that happen? Well, it actually happens on the first day. So the first practices that are actually done on this first week is actually immediately in the labs. We are looking forward into that uh, our labs are not different from the offices. Okay, and how about the graduation rate at software engineering? Well, the graduation rate is, well, I think around 50-60%, but it has a sense. You see, when you see the spark in a student, you immediately know that he came here just for a diploma or for actually the knowledge. The ones that came for the knowledge, they surely graduate. Okay, and how about working while studying? Does that happen? Well, this is actually very good practice. And I can say that the people that are actually working and studying are, well, most responsible ones. And we actually encourage this. And even more, we encourage to, to find them jo jobs. Okay, uh, and can you name some employers of your students? Well, actually, we're very proud to say that Ericsson, InfoBip Infinum 5, and also the top notch, the Google, the, uh, the Facebook, the Amazon. Just the other day, our colleague went to Amazon in Frankfurt. I can proudly say that our students go much further than we ever did. Wow, that sounds super cool. How about, you know, programming languages per se? Are they like different dialects of the same language? Well, you can surely say that. But, uh, well, the, the fact is that this video is going to be edited on a computer that actually was imagined and presented in a paper 80 years ago. So basically, this is all concepts. So the programming languages are based on the concepts that we actually teach our students. So these are only the dialects, as you said. It can be very, very quickly overcome, okay? So the students, when they learn, I don't know, two or three programming languages on algebra, they are actually capable of learning any language later by themselves. Wow. Wow, that sounds really, really interesting. And how about uh, the importance of continuing to study after the undergraduate level? Well, we, we put a great emphasis on that matter. It's, it's actually when you enter the IT industry, uh, the most important part of this is actually continuous studying. And we encourage this because we have the certification programs for our students and they surely can continue with the certifications as soon as they finish. And they can always go to the graduate study. Thank you, Daniel. See you at Algebra in Zagreb.